Okay, in this lesson, what we are going to uh, do is we are going to install and configure Notepad Plus Plus in Windows operating system. So, like you download any other software, just type Notepad Plus Plus download, and you'll find in one other website, and we'll download Notepad Plus Plus. Uh, let me open show this in folder what I'll, uh, let me copy this and I'll move it to I'll paste it here so I have this NPP and double click on this yes okay just remember this path we are not going to change this path If you want a shortcut, you can do that. You know, to run now itself, finish. So basically, Notepad++ is installed now. So if I go here, type Notepad++, it will work. But what I want is, if I open Notepad++, it should open. So I think I already configured path environment variable. I did delete them. Okay, let me open. So notepad plus plus okay see it's not working now what i want to do is same like vlc for vlc what we have done i want to configure what um the location where notepad plus plus ex is present and put it to path environment variable so there is a file called notepad plus plus dot exe you can see is an application and this is the path i will copy this and I'll go here. I'll type environment system environment variables. I'll choose and environment variables. Again, path edit. I'll go to the end. I will put a semicolon and I'll say control V to paste that path. See? Press OK. Three times. Now if I go here and again see one more thing you have to understand now also it will not work the reason is because this command line window is open with the previous environment variable values so I'll close this and I'll type cmd leave open that and now I type if I type notepad plus plus it just works fine let me go to d drive when I now notepad plus plus notepad plus plus the file which i add so we can use now notepad plus plus for our uh, java development so be aware we are not going to use eclipse and to do java development because i want the fundamental thing should be uh, set very clear so we'll use simple text editor like either notepad plus plus or sublime even notepad will do but this is recommended and down the line in our development journey i make sure that you'll also become expert in eclipse okay when that point comes we'll discuss about that and there's one last step is pending i am very lazy to write notepad every time so what i want to do is i just want to what um if i just type n notepad plus plus should open it is happening for me the reason is because what i did i uh, let me delete this it was not there earlier in your system it will not be there a simple thing which i have done i copied this notepad plus plus and pasted it here okay and then i renamed it to n that's it so now if i simply type n notepad plus plus will open so have this set up in your laptop will kickstart our development in the next lesson we will uh, configure another text editor called sublime and the reason is because sublime is more powerful than notepad plus plus and uh, it is also available for diversified platforms like linux mac and all so in the future lessons i'll be using a mac so there i'll be using sublime and it's totally your choice whichever the text editor you want to use